Her smile and air of mystery have gripped our imagination for more than 500 years. But could Mona Lisa finally be giving up some of her secrets? Scientist Pascal Cotte was given rare access to the painting at the Louvre Museum in Paris over a decade ago. Since capturing images of her, he's been scrutinising Leonardo's masterpiece using technology he's pioneered. The painting has been analysed by a multi-lensed camera under intense light. We can now analyse what's happened exactly inside the layer of paint and we can uh, peel like an onion all the layer of paint. He claims he's discovered an earlier portrait underneath the surface. And working from his scans of the painting, he was able to create this reconstruction of what he thinks that version of the Mona Lisa looks like. Side by side with the portrait of Mona Lisa today, uh, for me it's evident this is not the same woman. Take a look at the painting we all know. She's staring straight at you with that enigmatic smile. But in the newly discovered image underneath, Instead of that direct gaze, she's looking off to the side and there's no trace of that famous smile. There's always been debate about the Mona Lisa's true identity. Though over the centuries, it's been widely believed that she's Lisa Gherardini, the wife of a Florentine silk merchant. But how likely is it that she's actually a different woman? Art historian Andrew Graham Dixon has been studying historical documents together with this latest scientific research. I think the new discoveries are like a huge stone thrown into the still waters of art history. They disturb everything that we thought we knew about the Mona Lisa. There will probably be some reluctance on the part of the authorities at the Louvre to think about changing the title of the painting because that's what we're talking about. It's goodbye Mona Lisa, she is somebody else. The Louvre has declined to comment and the findings are dividing opinion. Leonardo constantly reworked his paintings, but not everyone's convinced by the findings suggesting another portrait underneath. They're ingenious in showing what Leonardo may have been thinking about, but the idea that there is that picture, as it were, hiding underneath the surface, I think is untenable. I think there's almost no doubt that it is Lisa. More than nine million people flock to see the Mona Lisa every year, imagining the story behind her smile. And after 500 years, it seems she's still keeping everyone guessing. Roya Nikar, BBC News in Paris.